G'day, today we're going to have a look at level 10 in the Sapphire DLC of Train Valley 2. This one is called River Name Barriage. Uh, we have 22 minutes, we have to build 5 or more bridges and we can't destroy any track tiles. Um, I've done the majority of this level and I failed because I made a, a silly mistake of building a bridge over an existing railway line. So I um, I failed because it destroyed track tiles underneath. Okay, so what do we got? We've got these workers on the side wood and chairs and so for that we need these five sort of places on the top then over here we have a hundred thousand dollar guy that needs 90 boxes so that's what i'm not too sure about is how much time i have to commit to that uh but we will find out okay so these guys are starting here and what i want to do is just make the fastest route possible out spare no expense um because we do not have much in the way of trains so I am going to just make this the most direct line from there to people. We also have this 10,000 purchase of um, workers down here. We do want to get... So we're going to need 24 wood. It's basically the first thing we're attempting to do. Let's just get that 24 wood on the board. Make our money. We'll speed things up a little bit here. Now there's more than 24 guys that have been delivered here. So what we'll do is we'll let this guy just arrive. Waited. We'll give our um, people a chance to build back up and we will send wood. So that's 8, 12, 16, 20, 24. Okay, so now we're going to need 36 more wood for the remaining chair, so we can start to send those guys. While we're doing that, let's um, get the rest of this connected. So we will run straight across there to get to him. Uh, and then we will run, try and go as direct as possible here. Let's see if we can just sort of cross the hills. Nice. These guys, so let's just keep sending guys down here till we've hit our, our mark. Um, although I can use these guys too, I suppose, to a little bit of that work. So, although it's more about having the available trains, I suppose. What we're going to do then is we're going to keep sending guys to wood uh, and we'll buy a third train. So that's 24 guys to wood so far. That's 20, that's his, the next four, so 24. The guy that's just left is 28. That's 32. And that's 36. So next up, what we'll do is we'll send guys all the way over to sand. Speed this up a little bit again. That's 16. 20. 24. Two, last one. Great. Okay. So the next thing that we'll do is we will buy planks, get them connected. 
And this will allow us to just make a bit quicker money. Then we can buy some more stuff. to get another train just to sort of keep the pace going with moving things around because we've got plenty to move moving those eight guys just to start the production happening with those so I think what we want to do is try and get like an essentially an initial 24 um, chairs being made that's eight that's 12 Let's buy that next train uh, that's 16. Twenty. Twenty-four. So that's our initial twenty-four. Wood. Um, we've now got twelve sand on their way to the glass. That's sixteen. Twenty four. Okay, we've got sixty thousand more. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna buy the crates and I'm just gonna set these two guys up as a nice straight line connection. Let's get him to start making crates because we're gonna need a whole bunch of them. That's the last lot of guys needed for the first 24 boards. Now I think the next thing we kind of want to do is just to start upgrading the trains. would be enough to allow me to upgrade one train. Um, I don't know if one would be uh, would be enough. It would be worth getting done rather. So that's 12, 16. Well, we've just got to wait for them anyway, so let's start to move of the wood because this will give us a bit more of a boost in um, money as well and we can probably upgrade a couple of trains speed that up quickly Okay, and then we'll upgrade the first two of our trains, we'll get, we only need eight, but we'll be able to get a nice quick 12 over there. Send as quickly the um, remaining 12 wood up that way. Send glass down. Hopefully these three trains should be enough to upgrade that last one. Got a 
make sure I don't forget about those crates down the bottom. But it is nice to already be in the world of um, six-seater trains. Okay, so then we need eight more guys over here. That's six. I mean, we can just send those two, really. Need to wait to send a full train for the sake of it. Okay, then I'll we'll start sending workers. Let's just send three guys down just to get it started. I'm going to buy our $100,000 upgrade on this side. Now, what, how many? Do I need five? Five bridges. Alright, and I guess we'll just wait a moment for I'm going to be ready to send. We'll send those guys. We'll send these guys. We really want to get those first sort of sets of chairs back too, because the faster they're back, the faster we can um, sort of spend some more money. So that's why I'm going to send just these two sets of glass and boards now while the gap's available, just to sort of just quickly bolster our money a bit more. So we're going to go two purchases of our first two bridges. I've got to make sure I don't forget the bridges. I feel like that's a real chance here. Get those first 12 brains. Get these last boards and glass sent. What we can do too is we'll just pause for a second. Um, I'm just going to swing him quickly into there. You can see this guy's already got 30 mate. He's a quick build um, for workers. So as those two arrive and we need 12 more guys. Oh, it might be faster just to do these 12, won't it? The huge amount. So I assume we will need them for the crates. But just quickly again. Bridges. Bridges out of the way, really, is what we want, so... Bridge there, and we'll go a bridge there. So we've hit that achievement. Requirement. Okay. Sorry, I do need six more after that, so let's send these... Six guys down there, too. And what we're going to want to do is get this guy just to... his way onto that path. Try and shorten his path as much as we can. Okay, so while those chairs are sitting there, the next thing that we're going to do is send the first 30 of these around. Well, it won't be 30, will it? Because we can only send four trains worth. Because we don't need to send those... those um, chairs anywhere. The only thing we need is um, just to have them ready to be delivered. So we definitely want to buy more trains to get this model moving faster. And I think it means that the, um, the chairs being delivered becomes the lowest priority, except for the money that they make us. I mean, this will be a sudden $120,000 gain that we get from these four trains arriving too. What we'll do is, as these trains arrive, we're going to send these workers all down this way. Like, 
because they're a much slower sort of gain, we may as well um, get them rebuilding their stock. Okay, so let's quickly get those chairs out. And again, for the money, I think now is our, our mindset. Alright. Then we can just send more of these across. So that's the chairs side of thing done by that last train. So let's just send as many trains as we can in this next lot, which will go. Just go the four. Let's go the four, and we'll get more workers on the way. And then we'll do a quick check of how many more workers do we need for this. So we've got three minutes. So that feels like that's getting a little bit tight. Okay, so the quick state of play. This guy's going to arrive, and we're going to have 42 more that we need. We currently have... 36 guys in there, so I think we're looking pretty good, because that's... I mean, this will be more than 42, right? It's 36, plus 5, it's 41, plus 4. Yeah, alright. That should cover us. So we'll let those two guys arrive. And then we will just flip those around. Just send these on their way. So that's 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42. Done. So interesting little management one, that one. Game time, super slow, fun's pretty ordinary, real time, killed it as always. Any uh, questions or comments, feel free to check them below. And until next time, catch you later.